Okay, the Rosa Brothers Milk Company has a new addition to its family. It's a handcrafted drink with its own twist on a traditional rice beverage, very popular in Mexico. Orchata is the newest flavor coming from this third generation family dairy and they are celebrating with a launch party. You are invited here to tell us all about it is Noel Rosa with Rosa Brothers Milk Company. Noel, how are you? I'm very good, how are you? I'm awesome. This is really exciting because I love horchata. I used to give it to my kids as, as when they were little. Great. And, and now that it's in milk form, first of all, no, tell everybody what horchata really is. Okay, well, horchata is a traditional drink uh, from Central America. Oh, it's Central America? It, I yes. thought it was Mexico. Well, it came up through Mexico. Oh, it actually okay, okay. started in Spain centuries and centuries ago. Oh. So it came up through Mexico. And what it is, is it's rice water. Okay. So uh, traditionally, it was made by taking rice, putting it in some kind of a permeable bag, maybe a gunny sack or something, putting it in water and letting it soak. The water would pick up the flavor of the rice, then they would add cinnamon and some kind of sweetener, uh -huh. and then that was your horchata. Yeah. So we thought we can make this with nonfat milk, okay. taste a little, bit, a little bit more body, a little bit better than just water, mm -hmm. and then we sweetened it and we, we just worked on it for a long time, wow. week after week, trying different, uh, different um, uh, combinations and permutations and we finally came up with what we think is is the horchata. So this is milk. This is not the actual rice water as you talk. Right, but okay. it does have rice added as well. Oh wow. So, and it's good for you obviously. But it's it's a non-fat milk. Yeah, yeah. So it Yes. I love it. Okay, so it's no, I've got to taste it. And while I taste it, why don't you tell everybody a little bit more about Rosa Brothers because you have expanded so much. How many years have you been around, though? So we're coming up on six years. Six years. Yes. Okay. And and then you started with what? What did you start with, and how did you expand? Yes. So originally we started out with the whole milk, which is the uh, red top, mm -hmm. the two percent non-fat, and then we came out with some real exotic flavors, the root beer float, mm -hmm. and then. Uh, later on, we came out with the orange cream sickle, and we came out with the uh, vanilla milk and several flavors. Uh, chocolate's always been a big favorite. We also have there in this short little bottle, uh, that's heavy cream. Wow. So, and then we have over there with a the silver cap, that's half and half creamer, coffee creamer. So, that's amazing. Yeah, we have quite a product line. In addition, we also have all of the ice creams. So all we of have the ice creams. 14 flavors. It's a super premium ice cream. Uh, we use all natural ingredients and we source the ingredients as locally as we can. Yeah. So like the pistachios come from our neighbor who's whose pistachio trees are about two miles from our cows. So, so you know it's fresh. We know it's fresh. This is absolutely delicious, by the way. Thank you. This reminds me of when I was growing up in Mexico. Sure. It's so, so great. You're having a launch party for it. When? Give us all the details. Party. Okay, launch party is at our small creamery in Tulare, right off the 99 freeway. Um, it's September. 20th. I, you know what? It's on the it's on the screen right there. Yep. September, 20th. September 20th. It's at 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Wait, it's July 20th, isn't it? July. <laughs> July 20th. Wait, that's too long for me to wait. This for Friday. This party. <laughs> it's actually this Friday, everyone. Yes. July 20th. This Friday, <laughs> July 20th, 11 to 2. Uh, we're going to be sampling the horchata. We've got a mariachi coming. We've got a taco truck coming. It's a party. Uh, we're going to have activities. We're going to have uh, prizes. We're going to have all kinds of things going on to, to launch this horchata. And then we are asking the public okay. to please vote for us. The Fresno Food Expo is coming up next week. Okay. And we need votes if they can come and try the product, if they like it vote for us for the Fresno Food Expo for the new product of the year. Yes. So that's what we're going for. Uh, the Fresno Food Expo is the following Thursday, and it's a great event, and we're, we're excited about it, and we think the horchata has a chance at winning new products. So where can people go to vote for the horchata? They can go to uh, the, uh, the Fresno the Food Fresno Expo. Fr food Expo yes. website, exactly. Fresno okay. Food Expo website. Well, remember, the, the horchata milk is available when, though? No. Right like, now. Uh, oh, so we, it's already available at the grocery stores. We started delivering to grocery stores today. That's fantastic. So it's got the purple top. Good. Good. So okay. That's now, a good way to remember. We also make these small. Uh, so these are a two-way glass bottle that you'll find in a supermarket. Yeah. These are a single serving uh, that you would find in a convenience store. No, I've got to ask, what's the difference of, of a glass bottle to the regular bottles that were used? Not bottle, but the cartons. Oh. What's the difference? What, what makes it better in a, okay. in a, in a glass? Uh, real simple. Okay. 
the glass bottle doesn't pick up flavors. So milk can pick up a plastic flavor or a cardboard oh. flavor. It doesn't pick up anything from glass because glass doesn't impart any flavor. Mm -hmm. The glass is also a great insulator, so it keeps your drink cold. Gotcha. And remember yeah. that you can return the glass. This right. is what I do. You can return it to the grocery store. So even if you look at the price and you think, oh, this is so much more, or it's not that much more, but you get your money back. Right. It's a $2 bottle deposit, yeah. but when you bring the bottle back, you get the $2 back. Yeah. Yeah. So that way, uh, it's very good for the environment. Nothing goes into the landfill, right? So I you just take it. it back. We wash it, we fill it, and we bring it back. What a great uh, company you guys have. What a great product you guys have. So please, folks, go to the website and vote on the horchata milk for the, the best new product. Best new, yeah. Best new product. New Product of the Year New Award. New Product of the yep. Year Award. All right. Well, we will definitely do that. In the meantime, rulesofbrothers.com for more information. And remember, they have ice cream, all sorts of flavors of ice cream as well. So this is fantastic. Thank you so much for being here, Noel. Well, thank you for I having us. I love it, love it, love it. All right, everybody, still to come. Every week, they seem to get cuter and cuter. Today, 